46 days last year, we had three mile or longer backups, traffic jams on the turnpike. 46 days and we had a 12 mile backup on Thanksgiving last year, right here at the same time. The sound you hear behind me is the sound of a, an economy yearning to come back. Last month, June 8th, we broke ground on the nation's largest mass transit project, uh, a new mass transit tunnel into New York City. And in so doing, we will relieve a major bottleneck. Today, we break ground on a project that will do the same for our highway system. We are on the avenue of commerce in America, right here. And it is absolutely essential that we make the investments today that allow us to be successful tomorrow. We will be putting to work over the next 12 to 18 months, 18,000 people on a day in and day out basis. And I'd like to thank uh, Governor Corzon with the stimulus package that he's putting out so that like not only me, other guys, because there's a list of guys at our hall that, that aren't working, uh, maybe they can get back out and, and feed their families, pay their bills, because the bills don't stop when I get laid off. Uh, and go back to work, because like uh, after 28 years, I'm used to working. I'm kind of used to working and I'd like to go back to work. More than a million people, a million vehicles, use the Garden State Parkway every day, making it the busiest toll road in the country. I think everybody knows the, uh, the tourist economy, tourism economy, produces about $40 billion, and it is essential that we provide the infrastructure to make that move freely. Hi, my name is Jim Episali. I own an antique shop and post a gallery in Barnegat, New Jersey. Uh, the expansion of the parkway can do nothing but help my business and all the other shore businesses and tourism in general. We do a good year-round business, but our serious collectors from North Jersey and New York tend not to come down in the summertime because the traffic is too heavy. We look forward to the completion of this project so that we can see more business down, down here. This will put many, many people to work throughout the next year and throughout the summer. $200 million worth of work, and I, we need it here, we need it for our residents, and we need to make sure people are back to work. Uh, I just want to say thank the governor, thank the authority and thank uh, the Department of Transportation, but most of all thank the governor for the people he's going to put to work today and the people he's going to have working uh, throughout the economic lifetime of New Jersey. Uh, this turnpike has been a, uh, a essential element of economic development for our state and with this widening it will continue to do so. So thank you very much. Governor Corzine.